What's up, guys? My name's Sean, and I'm the host of the NET Talks podcast, and we're back with another episode. Uh, as you can see, I'm not at the office today. I'm recording from home, but the show must go on. But nevertheless, I'm here with an exclusive episode. Now, I'm here with one of three uh, of the co-founders of the Bulls on the Block collectible NFT project. Now, it's one of the hottest projects out there at the moment, and he's sharing his story about how he teamed up with the other guys to create these collectibles. He also shares about how the Bulls on the Block team are collaborating with Floyd Mayweather uh, on the first celebrity NFT collectible that is available in the space. Not that I know of anyone's dropping it, but these guys are doing it properly. They've been very successful. Um, they've sold out uh, all the Bulls on the Block and they're teamed up with Floyd. So you're going to get all the information of how it happened, how it came about, uh, what they're looking to do, uh, and also when are things about looking to drop. So make sure you keep tuned in. Uh, make sure you subscribe and also share to anyone that you feel that'd be valuable to and at least help build this community. So we're uh, back with another episode of NFT Talks, and I'm here with Rui, who is one of the co-founders of one of the hottest projects at, at the moment called Bulls on the Block. Now, it's an NFT project that involves um, bulls, <laughs> 10,000 collectibles that come with, obviously, benefits. We're going to talk about the roadmap, but um, there's really, it's really interesting things happening with this project, so I'm really excited to have him on and some amazing arts. So um, welcome, Rui. No oh. It's a pleasure to be with, with you, Sean. Thank you for having it. Yeah, I mean, we've been trying to get this um, episode uh, ongoing for a while, but finally we, we, we got together. So um, I'm grateful for that. Yeah, you know, the NFT space is quite hectic <laughs> and uh, we have um, plans uh, not only for Bulls on the Block, but for, for the space itself. We are pushing forward the new boundaries related to 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 this kind of approaches to trade projects and how we can optimize it and, and diversify it and connect the community. So it has been uh, quite stressful. So we managed to find out a bit of our morning and, 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 and let's do it because um, uh, this is, this is a, a, great, a great moment and a great um, field of new um, experiences that, that we can learn and, and 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 talk about so yeah yeah I'm, like I said, fire I'm, them away my friend let, let, yeah let's away. go man let's, let's let's jump before we jump straight into it like i always like to just because the nft space is so new i mean i feel like yeah. when you're in the community you feel like you know people like and yeah. I, I, I know about you and, and so i feel like i've got some kind of connection to you but everyone at the space we're all strangers <laughs> you know so mm -hmm. we, need, we just yeah. just give a bit get just give a bit of perspective introduction about yourself um, okay. And a bit about your background, because I know you're an artist, an award-winning artist by that, and and also just talk to on how you got into the NFT space. Okay, good. So um, I, I'm I'm 44 years old. I, I was born in 77. Okay, and for the 25 first years of my life, I was um, I had pretty rough childhood with uh, um, really. Um, struggling with uh, some of the basics needs and, and it, it was a uh, part of household. Mm -hmm. And um, I just grew fascinated by, by the drawing perspective, but um, uh, without the possibility to do any higher studies. So I, I did uh, the basic um, studies in, in, in Portugal. And then I, I started um, in, in some jobs. I ended up in the city hall um working in some uh sketches for the architects to to validate and and some of the drawings for the city halls okay. this was my my day-to-day -day job um that i was not fulfilled with but at night i i i i, I just illustrated illustrated and illustrated it, it 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 has become my obsession uh for 30 years now and um when when I became aware that uh, there might be something uh, of value in, in, in that, that process, I started to do some sketches and drawings for, for friends, then uh, tried to, to, to enter this um, caricature world 
where uh, uh, someone would would like to to purchase a, um, a kind of um, interpreted version of themselves done by me yeah. and this is was 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 the process that that i did I, how long, how long did that take you Rui, like to, to the point where you started selling art because there's a I'm sure we we got we get the I get the impression with a lot of art, artists you got the, the you got the saying is the starving artists they don't get paid they don't yeah they, yeah, yeah. They, they struggle so how long did it take you to get paid and were you getting paid yeah. to live? like it's close mm-hmm. to fifteen years now it was wow. close to the the thirtieth that or the uh, twenty nine twenty eight uh, I don't remember more but uh, but it was around the that that area that I I. I ended up uh, quitting my city mall, um, city mall, city hall um, job, and then did, dedicated myself fully to, to this part. But okay. it was always um, so. The, the the process of learning um, becomes um, a, a, a two way street. One is uh, clearly self taught, yeah. so I didn't did, uh, did any any college or master's degree on on this this part on any um specific studies on 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 art but i i was drawing eight to ten hours a day daily okay so it (laughs) it was just the the obsession about drawing and the the focus on doing the the one thing that i love more on related to the professional perspective and and um, i improved the the skills i i started to um connect with my close network and understand that they 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 saw value in in what i've done and and for the last close to 15 years um uh, it it has been my 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 main and only source of income and um until two or three years ago it was it was okay um last two or three years i i jumped into a, a new passion of mine a new one that is tattooing Okay. And uh, I started to do tattoos, and um, yeah, I was uh, I was doing okay with with this uh, connection. It's not that uh, um, the vision of an artist that is trying to surviving on the street. Uh, I, I I was well referred. I did um, um, a lot of drawings for for some commissions for private commissions, the tattooing mm-hmm. part, and some live events also. So. When um, you know that uh, today some corporate team building activities have like, um, so imagine our talk, okay? Yeah. We will discuss several topics. Yeah. And there might be an artist listening to the talks and drawing um, what are the key topics that are uh, being discussed yeah. in a visual perspective, perspective, like an infographic or something. And at the end of the meeting, that is a visual piece that represents what the, the corporate team building or the corporate event yeah. uh, presented. Okay, so uh, these uh, usually paid off uh, very decently, and also some events like you go to a concert, you, uh, you and the brand asks you to to do like uh, caricatures for the fans, yeah. and you stay there, you do some. So it was this kind of approaches that uh, enabled me in the last. Two or three years to to thrive as an artist and as um, and 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 have a, a very decent and 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 the justice life with with no no struggles at all. Okay, yeah, you you've cre- you clearly put based on even the little introduction you said in regards to your journey so far. You clearly put the hours in <laughs> in regards to yeah, yeah, yeah your yeah. skills and whatnot. Like it isn't a thing that you just picked up. You dedicated a lot of time yeah to this. so what, what i'm really interested in is how does it yeah it's going to be the the part where you obviously we get to the nfts and how does yeah. that change how does that change your life like how, okay what yeah. happens on there let me just ask, uh, ask you or, or talk to you about two things that that is okay cool. one of one of the the aspects regarding uh my approach is, is that that uh, um that practice, that obsessed practice about being better at, at drawing and illustrating, really, really makes a difference. So mm. when when I'm when I'm finishing the day and I I'm fin- I'm drawing for something, an objective or a purpose or a commission that I'm drawing to others, mm. um, I I just rest a bit, uh, connect to the family, and then uh, I ended up at at the sofa drawing for myself. Okay, so it's. 
when I'm um, I'm relaxing about the, today's work, I'm doing, I'm I'm I'm, I'm training again on this perspective. And uh, I don't know if you you saw uh, it was it was a, a blind magician, Richard uh, Taylor. I think it's his name. Do you okay. know? Are you familiar with Richard Taylor? No. Uh, no. Richard Taylor is a, a blind magician magician that does. Uh, that was uh, practicing like 14 hours a day for 20 years and he does some magic amazing magic tricks being yeah. blind so this is this is this is um, pretty amazing and he, he says one thing that is very important that is uh, perfect practice makes perfect it's not practice okay. it's just perfect practice so i ended up uh, obsessing myself with, uh, with doing the, the, the finding the, the right style and finding different styles and practicing a lot and a lot and a lot. And, and this, this, this helped me through the process of being accepted as, as, as a good artist and um, to, to, to present some of the, the, um, the, the, the works in, in, in some, some international awards uh, projects and, 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 and this is how I, I ended up. Okay, okay. so uh, fast fast forward to March two thousand twenty one. Um, I got a call from a, a close friend of mine that um, uh, asked me if I knew anything about NFTs, and I said that yeah, that 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 that, that I don't know anything about that. So <laughs> that, that what 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 you wrote here, yeah, I, I have no clue. Yeah, and he, he told me. Okay, so uh, I think you sh you should check it out, and I, I think you should dedicate at least one one day a week for these kind of things and and see if um, if this works out for you because that's, that's I, a I good friend. That is an incredible, yeah, that, <laughs> I think there is an incredible incredible opportunity here, uh, and he um, he just pushed me on 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 the the right direction, and mm -hmm. actually it was more than helpful because he if found me a designer to do the, the portfolio. He helped me with the the the, um, the applications to foundation and mm -hmm. uh, and uh, makers uh, place and uh, known origins. So that that basic platforms when you start your your um, your journey as as an artist because the first idea and the first direct idea when you enter to the space is that there are tons of artists, yes. some platforms to expose your work. So the rational thing to do is get your uh, older artists that are only uh, your oldest works that are only JPEGs and uh, they they have no intrinsic value for you until that moment and understand that the process of value is quite different from that you understood uh, value mm -hmm. in the last twenty five years. So yeah, that's interesting. Value becomes different, and when when I understood the two key added points on, on, on this perspective, that is provenance is evaluated and um, the blockchain enables you to keep track of the royalties, the full crypto space ecosystem that values things in a different way and values um, not only the, the, the one-to-ones, but the originality and um, it is willing to expect revenues in a couple of years mm -hmm. uh, space because this is so new to all of us. Um, I thought that um, this could, could, could be a good thing. Additionally, I was working mainly to Portugal, okay? So it, it, the possibility to expose and to connect uh, with um, worldwide collectors uh, also show okay. me that there is a possibility that if my my work is praised for some of the people in Portugal, there might be collectors that fall in love with some of my work outside in in in, in the world. So, yeah. um, what was it? So, what, was it success it like? what was the success like then? But when you first, because you're telling me that, okay, then these obviously balls on the block wasn't your first. No, no, yeah. Introduction. So you've been in the NFT space. You've been introduced. You've joined all yeah. these popular marketplaces in regards to like foundation marketplace. Yeah. Uh, uh, non origin. Like, so what did you have any success straight away? Yeah. And so success as uh, three sales, steps. as in sales, yeah. I should say maybe. Yeah, success as three steps for me since um, since this 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 three months that that feel like well, <laughs> like three years. Okay, so <laughs> yeah. The first thing is that on 
April 11th, I dropped my, my first NFTs in foundation. Okay. Mm -hmm. And in the first weekend, I sell one, uh, 11,000 euros wow. of uh, work. Okay. So this is the first success. Mm -hmm. And the NFTs were in a time, uh, all time high. So everything uh, was pretty much being collected. That, that, that was decent call, uh, quality or uh, appealing for the eye. Mm -hmm. It was being collected. So that, that, that was amazing. And also that gave me um, a, a, a sense of reality that, that was not the real reality that, that was to come on uh, later April and, and beginning of May, okay? Because it was yeah. an all-time high. I didn't understand that it was an all-time high. Yeah. So I was just excited with um, what, what was there. Um, so I, I sold Samuel L. Jackson. I sold the, my, my Genesis uh, Mint with, uh, it was an interpretation and a tribute to people mm -hmm. and um, a couple of more. And it was $11,000. Eleven thousand uh, dollars. Ethereum was like three thousand uh, dollars, um, one mm -hmm. one one coin at, at mm -hmm. the time, and so it it was it was unbelievable. Okay, so what happens then is a kind of a, a bit of a bubble burst, and 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 the sales stop, and yeah. I had close to six or seven uh, works in in foundation, and in that moment. Um, they weren't picking up and I started understanding more the space because I was not drawing for, for foundation. The only draw that I did, actually I did two, did, did, did the, the Genesis piece on, on, on people and then yeah. did um, uh, an interpretation of um, Paris Hilton because she yeah. entered the space at, at, at that moment. Yeah. And, and, and that one is still available on foundation to be, to be bought. Okay. So, when I, I looked at it and said, mm, uh, th this is not going with, with the momentum that we got on the first weekend. Yeah. So I took the chance, I, I took the moment to understand what the space was, was about. And then um, I, I, I did a deep dive on um, what's in store for, 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 for that. And I saw, of course, I was familiar with, with CryptoPunks, but I saw uh, board apes getting launched okay. and i saw some of the, the trades projects and also i was uh, following um um the trajectory of um some of the the, the influencers on the space i saw crypto punks comic and i was understanding that there is a different um approach other than uh, being an artist that mm -hmm. publishes their, their their works, okay. So this 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 uh, this was the beginning of, of of phase two. And phase two, what I did was, what if I interpreted some of the uh, digital art that is in in the space? I I started up by by doing some crypto punks. Um, in my style, I sent it to a couple of, of people. You have. Um, like DC Investor and Kevin Rose. Kevin Rose has a, a beautiful podcast on 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 high finance and DeFi, and okay. he talks about the NFTs. That called that's called Modern Finance, and I heard a couple of of them, and and um, and and really uh, gave me also an added perspective to to the NFT space. So I I ended up uh, sending. Um, their crypto punk on my perspective on my interpretation as drawing yeah. and uh, they were very well uh, accepted so they were putting them into their collection so this is i ended up understanding that they uh, were quite connected to the crypto oh. punks they had mm -hmm. and then i sent it oh so i uh, i'm sending this as as an nft for you and then you ended up with a collection of a three three forty seven. That is their punk with the different yeah. perspectives, and, and I understood by then what is a derivative. That is an interpretation okay. um, of the, the the piece, the original piece from a collection that you have. Yeah. So this was the second moment to, for me to understand that I could do work, and work would be value valued by the owners of the original piece, uh, and they were willing to pay for it. Okay, so that, that was the second point. 
from that point on, that there, there was a key moment uh, in in one day. I don't remember the the, the day. Uh, Two a.m. I I ended up buying my 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 board ape uh, yes club um, um, ape. Yeah. So um, I paid like point four for it. I I think it's point four point four something. Okay. And in in that moment, it was my first act as a collector. So uh, until then. I was only another artist and, and I was not a collector on, on the space. So the first investment that I did with some of the, the fees that I received from, from, from the, the NFT space was uh, uh, um, uh, an ape. And um, it was quite a doubtful uh, situation. Actually, I, will, I was then uh, the floor of Bored Apes came, came down pretty much and, and I was... Uh, not certain if that was a, a, a good uh, choice at the yes. moment because yeah you, you need to understand it I, I, I'm an artist I'm not a, an investor and it, it was really uh, the project was getting um, good good feedback and a good vibe and people were connecting one why, why one did you collect, the other. why did you go why did you choose to collect the board eight that the board eight is clear they've, they've, they've done something. Uh, I mean, I spoke to I spoke to some apes on the podcast already. Yeah, I spoke to other guys. They've clearly done something right. They've clicked in a way that they can connect to so many people that yeah, they it desire was, to save. Like <laughs> it was that um, it was uh, FOMO because it felt <laughs> quickly, and also the 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 um, the Twitter space was all of the sudden um, interacting in a different way and connecting to one another. And I thought that um, it could work for me to, to connect in, in the Twitter space. You, ah, you need to okay. understand that I had, I had no, no Twitter until um, April. Yes. And I understood, uh, understood painfully that for an artist to thrive in the NFT space, he has to do two things. One is have good art. And the second is to do uh, a lot of engagement and to get known and visibility in Twitter. And I have, um, I, I had none of the Twitter interactions. So valid point, valid in, point though. I, I mean, I respect that. I, I like the put the two points you put out there is that because a lot of artists will obviously create their work, but they don't feel that they well they they may not want to engage. Which and, is important, very important. It, it is critical, Sean. And yeah. I I took three to four hours a day just interacting. And eight hours a day drawing, and every day from um, April onwards, after after the the the, the big sell on the weekend, I mm -hmm. thought, okay, this is game changer. So I need to transform my life. And and I, um, my friend told me one day a week, and I was doing seven days a week. So it's quite mm -hmm. from from mid April onwards, it was seven days a week. So every day is Monday for me. So it's it's, it's kind <laughs> of hard. Um, but but it, it is life changing in this in, in this perspective that we see that the space goes um, in, in in very fast speed. So yeah. it, it's impossible for you to to break a bit, or you will be out of 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 Sink. of the, <laughs> the, the 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 scene. Yeah. And also because I needed to do both engagement and artistic perspective, so it's really 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 uh, hard. So when when you see now that um, um, my account has 4.5K uh, followers on, on, on Rui Duarte, and we have 10, 10K followers on, on Bulls on the Block, but that 4.5 came from this step two. And the okay. step two was by connecting with apes, ape follow ape enabled me to really have an affinity point where we can talk about different things and it was not me pushing or, or shielding my art. It's me with my friend Zape talking about different stuff and um, understanding what the kind of when a community like that likes and 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 looks uh, uh, forward to the future. Is, and in is, that moment, yeah, for sure. So, so Rui, I was going to say, is that? A, I just want. I don't want to mix it. Is that a saying? Ape follow ape. Is, is, do we? Are people actually saying that within the community? I yeah, uh, ape follow it. ape. Ape follow ape is a movement in which uh, the unique holders that have an ape in the profile um, have a tendency to immediately on 
on Twitter follow the new apes. And so what wow. happens is that um, you ended up having two profiles. You, Sean, have a profile, mm -hmm. but then you have the profile for your ape also. Some people substitute their avatar with the, the ape and, and stay in the main account. Mm -hmm. Some people create a new account only for the ape and they manage both accounts. I have my account as, as a new, unique account, mm -hmm. but I had my profile change for the ape. And now I have my ape and my bull on my, on my Twitter account and they, they are forever friends, uh, not the summer or the spring, as uh, Placido Domingo said in, in, in the Barcelona uh, uh, song, the, the Olympic uh, Games Barcelona song. He, yeah. he had a, 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 a saying that was, friends for life, not just a summer or a spring. And this is the, the way that I see bulls on the block and, and my ape going forward because trades project, as we will discuss at the later stage of, of, of the show for sure, yeah. um, have been um, pushed uh, forward uh, in, uh, insanely for uh, not only artists, but, but also developers in order for them to to try to to get a bit of uh, the the hype that they they have been uh, collecting, one of some of them are beautiful designs. Some of mm -hmm. them has have uh, good foreseen utility. Some of them are uh, not well um, um, worked upon, and they just try to 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 collect of of the hype and form of of a new project. So uh, I see the trades uh, project seem to change radically. Uh, in the next six months, and, and, and okay. it will become a different thing. I can share uh, some of the, the thoughts on that at a later stage. Okay. But what, what I saw in that moment is the apes um, connected in a different way, and I needed the engagement, and I needed the reason for me to consider other people as peers on the relationship part and the, as potential buyers on the derivatives part. So. I had the insight of personalizing the crypto punks according to the owner's needs. Yeah. For that, it was pretty natural to migrate the personalization aspect to board apes. Okay. And I, do, I did um, two or three of them, yeah. connected with some of um, the apes and, and, and show them, um, what, what do you think about this approach? Uh, would you be keen on buying them by 0 .005, 0 0.05? Um, um, and if it showed... How much is that uh, at the time? Sorry, 0 0.05. Uh, round uh, it was close to um, like 100 pounds, 130 okay. euros. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's not, it, it was not too much, but imagine I, 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 I take... One hour to do to yeah. one hour and a half to to do a, a good uh, derivative that is personalized to to the um, to the owner. Then I say I share to them the picture. They give feedback. I adjust it and then I mint it and 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 set a private sale to them. Okay, so okay. that was the process. Yeah, and at that moment, it just um, exploded in in desire because the derivatives were really 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 a sweet spot to be because when I imagine Sean, you do, do you have an ape by any chance? No, I, I haven't. I mean, I feel, I feel, le I feel so left out. I was, a, I, I had a chance. <laughs> oh, you did? I had, oh, I had a chance. I was there early and um, I was in the clubhouse when they were doing the first. Oh my thing. God. Yeah. So, I regret it every day, but you know, that's, that's any, like one day. Uh, <laughs> we have, we have uh, a lot of regrets every day yeah. on these projects that fly, but also we really need to be mindful that we can't we can tackle everything. So it, yes, it's yeah, important. True. It, it's important for us to understand this. Well, in the last twenty days, I felt a bit behind on the projects that are um, interesting, and um, and and it's so hard to keep up with with it and with with the projects of Bulls on the Block and. And just uh, monitor the space is hard enough, and and it's a full time job. Drawing and 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 managing and co founding uh, uh, an institution makes you a bit behind on on those topics. Some some of them um, are really interesting on 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 the beginning, but some of them like apes were in, by two weeks they they were 
the, the, I, I bought mine by, by 0.4 and they were uh, 0.1. And so I was losing money if I was to sell. Actually, I, have, I had my ape list listed yeah. by 0.5. Um, and um, when the floor was swept by the, the collectors and it went to 0.5, Mm -hmm. And I was already very deep into the derivatives perspective. I ended up delisting it because the, my, my ape was the connection point. So this okay. was the, the way where the other people would say, oh, this is one of us doing derivatives. It's not an artist trying to Come enter the space, space and, <laughs> and, yeah, and, and commission the space. Yeah, that, that's it. So I ended up delisting it and, and then... Um, uh, the rest is history. So I ended up doing one, close to 100 personal derivatives of uh, wow. board apes. Okay. I did 67. I think it was 67 of, of them until the end of May. Yeah. Until the end of May. And, and I was committed to, to that. I, 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 I shared with the community and, and, and the requests just kept on, on, on entering because, um, if if you if you have an ape, John, and and you say, okay, so this is my ape, yeah. But um, I would like my ape to be uh, 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 um, showcased as a post podcast host, okay, yeah. with um, 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 the Tower of London on the or the London Eye at at the end, yeah. um, and uh, drinking with a, a mug with uh, this kind of drawing and. Yeah. Uh, whatever uh, so this kind of personalization was really 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 interesting for okay. them so it's the ape adapted to, to the, the owner okay okay so and and i had from the 100 apes that i've designed so far i yeah. saw the owners sell the ape of three or four not more okay so they the the, the derivative has value to the ape and ah. they ended up staying with the ape because it has really connect meaningful meaningful connection with with, with them so that's I've really done, interesting that is that's yeah. really interesting like I mean that's a, that's a site that isn't really spoke about I don't feel I, I mean I see it in the community I see people doing uh what you do in regards to the, the customization would, would call it but um yeah. I didn't know that Pete, there's there's a value to it but it makes sense it makes sense that if it, if there, it is going to have value it's going to have value in the eights community because I thought they're one of the strongest communities out there at the mm -hmm. moment when it comes to collectibles and moving forward like that moves on to i understand that the team for balls in the block was formed in the eight yeah. is that right yeah that's it so yeah. um in 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 those derivative uh, moments uh damp and bobo reached me and said Rui, we we really like your heart uh, mm -hmm. so um we were thinking about doing um project uh, trades project similar to board apes inspired by board apes yeah um can we do um something with you where we 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 split the revenues and 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 um, and we we divide it in, in in three parts yeah and and it was a different approach um that we were seeing in 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 the in the community because we were seeing artists being commissioned by this is the work we are the developers or we are the strategist yeah. and uh, I, I will just pay for the work and 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 it's a different perspective so um we we connected very well and we started uh, sending ideas um in this bilateral approach how the long does the process idea. take how long does this process take that's something from this point that you're speaking to each other and you've got this idea to the point where you start obviously creating these characters these ball characters um mm -hmm. how, how long does it take roughly i mean because i'm always interested to hear like the how long does, how much work is put into and i understand there's a lot of work but what's the time scale yeah yeah the, so the time scales is one thing the amount of work is another one <laughs> yeah. but the, the, yeah it's because it was um from um i would say it was i think let me just, uh, I think it was from the four, the fourteen or fifteen of May, yeah, until the the twenty seventh of June. Okay, it okay. was close to forty days from connecting 
to yes. deploying um, and sell out the bulls on the block in 19 wow. minutes. Okay, so it's close to 40. That's, that's still amazing. That's, I mean, we've got, it's I can imagine, unbelievable. That's amazing. It's, it's unbelievable. Okay, and it's unbelievable. You have to understand because it's we have two or three things that are really important. So Bobo and, and Damp are, are developers that are hugely focused. Okay, so they have they have uh, quit their jobs and they were deploying uh, 12 to 14 hours a day on everything that is related to the website, the blockchain, yes. and the algorithm that we need to to deploy the the trades. Okay, yeah. I was doing. 12 to 14 hours a day, drawing and handling the topics wow. related to, 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 to media, okay? Social media, Twitter, and, and the, at a later stage, Discord, okay? And the only way that we have managed to do this is that we were obsessed and focused on deploying bulls on the block. And we, we everything uh, went out of the way in order for us to, to pull this in, in this perspective. And it was, it was so, so, so time consuming, but so focused. And we knew exactly the steps going forward that it, it was the only way possible, okay? Usually you should have at least four people, two for development, one yeah. for strategy and social media and one for art, okay? At least four people for you to deploy this. And um, what, what happened here, it was, a very lucky connection mm. into uh, what how the developers explain what was needed from the artist perspective and how the artists communicate the, the, the vision for them to implement. So I had full creative uh, liberty on the okay. way that uh, the artist, the, the art should, should project. And um, um, they had the, the space of mind to focus on the development perspective, mm -hmm. while I handled the, the Twitter and, and the, 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 the that, that kind of perspective. So let, let, let me ask you a technical question. Yeah, yeah. Coming here, like, how do you, okay, you, it's 10,000 pieces, yeah? Yeah. 10,000 NFTs. Um, you, there's, I think as I mentioned, is it, is it 250 items? Uh, yeah. It's five different species. How yeah. do you, and you, you mentioned that the devs they 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 create the algorithm algorithm. So is it like an AI system that you put the mouth, you put the you, you create the eyes, you create yeah. the ears, you create the clothing, and then an AI system kind of randomly picks um yeah. is that how it works. So it, yeah, roughly is that 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 way. So yeah. what you do, you do the bases, the mm -hmm. furs and, and the species. Mm -hmm. And in, in Bulls on the Block, we had Two beliefs going forward, and it was one uh, that we need to work on the aesthetic part, and yeah. we for that we ended up doing specific mouses for zombies, aliens, and and robots and lavas, mm -hmm. and this this created a problem on rarity that we can talk a bit later on, but okay. uh, but the, the, it's 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 lesson learned, and we are always learning on, on the space. So that 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 is the the topic, and also the topic of the community wallet, because going forward on on bulls on the block. We understood that we had to 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 bring a, a new USP, a unique selling proposition that could differentiate uh, us from 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 some other trade projects, and we we yeah. came up with with the 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 looks of of the bulls should be uh, clearly better than the the trade projects that were uh, being showcased on on the moment, mm -hmm. and also the. Um, the community wallet idea that was um, um, an idea from I think um, Bobo and 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 Bo and Damp came up with the name Bulls on the Block, and uh, I I brought the topic of the bulls because we were exercising with different things and actually the bear was the first uh, the yeah. first interaction that we did. Why so animals? The bear would though? be nice. Why, why animals? Why are animals doing so well? I'm just there's something that I don't yeah. know. Well, you got you got the kitties, you got the apes. You've yeah, got it's, cats, it's you've got the goats. <laughs> They're all so, animals. Why, why not humans? Is there a reason for that, or is it just a, a thing? So when you start mimicking and getting inspired by apes, mm -hmm. the next the next natural steps was if people buy apes, probably they can buy another animal. Okay, so that that is okay. the first step of of rationale. We we did two iterations. Uh, mm -hmm. One was. Uh, animal-based we did bears pandas and bulls and we ended up with the bulls because the bulls 
really relate to the space. It's it's the powerful animal of the space. It relates yeah. to crypto. It has good good potential of drawing, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Okay. But, but we did um, a different um, um, approach with um, um, a different thing that 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 we will probably hope to release at a later stage end of uh, the year in a connection with the brand. But we when we we did that, it was. Um, because people can really relate and understand the concept because Bored Ape was a success at, a success at the time. Yeah. So we really need to, while, while the space is still uh, based on these early adopters, 10 to 10 to 15K people that all buy the same, the same stuff. So I, I bought an ape and then I bought a camel and then I bought a, a, a chameleon and then I bought whatever. That was mm -hmm. what, what was being showcased at the time. So yes. we are catering to the same people and the same people, it's easy for them to understand yes. that, oh, it's a, pro a project similar to Bored Apes with two key unique um, um, offers that we haven't seen so far, that is community wallet. So 1.5% of the revenues go to community wallet and we can spend it whatever uh, we please. And yes. the second point is, oh, this actually real, uh, looks really good. So maybe it will worth more at a later stage as the apes did. So this was the foundations for us to, to do uh, animal traits. And, uh, and then we did something that was not, that was not seen at the moment. So okay. you, you need to understand that traits project become um, a, a bit of uh, the developers and the artists are a bit of anon. Okay, so you don't see Oh, them you, you don't know really who is behind the project so and, yeah. and we have we have saw we have seen some rug pulls based on that 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 perspective so it's very easy for people to uh, just cash in and and uh, and and leave the the investors um um uh with with, 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 with their money lost <laughs> basically yeah, yeah yeah with the nft <laughs> and nothing more okay? yeah, yeah and we have seen some some of the cases and yeah. what we understood there in the perspective of the, the strategy and the long-term perspective is that if we push by having the artist as the co-founder, if we push, push the narrative yeah. based on the, the, the artist and the skills, it, be, it will reinforce the confidence of the public that the project has a long-term viability. So okay. it's Rui's project. And Rui will not just take the money and leave because he has a reputation and he is a an established artist in the NFT space. So yeah. as I had um, strong connections with the apes, um, a good visibility in the NFT space as an artist, and I was pushing a project that was aesthetically pleasing with a community wallet. And so when you go thick and, and looking for uh, uh, possible red flags on a new project. Mm. You couldn't mark bull, bulls on the mark with anything other than in real life experience, because actually it was our first uh, project in the NFT space in, in this perspective. So we, we didn't have the proof experience to show that it would um, end well for, for the NFT owners. Okay, so that was was lacking for sure because yeah of course it, it was the first yeah yeah but the other points um it was really interesting because we had 0 0.08 we had no bounding no bounding curve it was everything um uh revealed on the minting it was not um uh it was not projected for you to the the rarity points will, would not be shared uh, prior to the the drop it's of the collection um so it's um it it really inspired confidence for those that um, that were looking for the space i think that and um, this... so, so i was going to say yes, sure. point, i was going to say the thing that like um based on what you're saying i can just, i'm just kind of putting everything together like with it, without knowing strategically you guys have kind of you're you're part of the community you're making nfts for the community so you, you clearly understand that part you're in a community where eight follow a so you've already got a following within a following already before you've even done a project. And then you've yep. also, with yourself, you've built that credibility outside that community to also to get that. And 
also your work's great or, already. So you, yep. all these elements are just coming together without... That's I mean, the puzzle <laughs> that is being assembled. Yes, Jan, <laughs> that is the puzzle. So, and, and now you, you see immediately the consequences. So I teased bulls on the block for one week in my Twitter, okay? okay. And then the hype builds up from the artists, not mm -hmm. from the project, okay? Mm -hmm. So the people that know Rui and understand the art and foresee that the project has potential, start yeah. sharing the project. And yeah. then after one week, I reveal the bulls on the block Twitter handle. And when I do that, immediately in 24 hours, I get 2,000 followers. Wow. So, it's not, so it's not the bulls on the block pages that tries to get momentum and connect to the other. Mm -hmm. I immediately redirect the focus and the attention of the project that I was teasing and I was sharing why this project really is different from the others because it's co-founded by the artist. It is the, the, the aesthetics are really differentiation. Mm -hmm. One bull, one story, um, the, the community wallet, the, um, the 0 0.08 uh, uh, no bounding curve. So all of these points build up the hype and momentum. And then mm -hmm. immediately when the Twitter handle is revealed, immediately we have traction on that part and we can uh, transfer the narrative also to bulls on the block. And on the second week, we communicated from Rui Duarte and we communicated from um, Bulls on the Block. And um, five or six days, I, I think it was, no, it was a full week prior to the Twitter um, perspective, we opened up Discord. And when we open up Discord, um, it starts from, it, it comes from a communication perspective, that is Twitter we control the narrative and we yeah. say what and when we know we want, we, we, we bring it to the relationship. And from that moment on, um, the hype is built up by the community and not by the developers or the artists. Okay. So how, we ended how up- members, How many members do you have in your Discord? At that point, so, before you drop, how many members yeah, do you we, have? It's, it's pretty much the same now. We have six, uh, 6K Discord on okay. the 26th of- uh, June, June, yeah, right. 26th of June when we dropped, and now we have 6.2k also. Okay, so we okay. we ended up having close to 5.5, 5.4, I think, mm -hmm. uh, at the later stage, one week after the drop, and then we 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 get uh, uh, now we are close to 6.2 again. But so um, it it at at the moment was the most uh, expected uh, expected trade project at, at, at the moment with uh, uh, close to 5k twitter members and close to 6k uh, discord members discussing gas asking me to yeah. postpone the drop uh, because the kids had uh, football practice asked me <laughs> to postpone the drop because they were landing at uh, yeah. 6 p.m and uh, the drop yeah. was at 7 p.m so they were not in time to to, to reach and, and some actually a couple of guys asking me to drop after the 25 because 25 was the day that they were paid on their, uh, their, their jobs and they needed the money to, to buy some bulls. So it's, it, it was, the, um, the FOMO was, was huge. The hype was huge. And, and this, 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 this took a toll on us because um, with, with the, the, the insane gas wars that, that we had. Yeah. And um Having, having the project being um, uh, sold out in 19 minutes with, with just only 950 unique holders, it was a bit of a, a bittersweet moment. That's, we that's were amazing. Just, that is, I'm just, I'm just saying that it's great. Let's, let's go back. Let's take away the artist. Let's take away the, the project. I want to ask you, yeah. uh, yourself as an individual, as a human being, um, how did you feel when, when, you, when it sold out in that amount of time? I mean, you put the word... Yeah. I mean, it's, it's, um, it's, it's, it's finances. I know it's not all about the money, but it's a lot of money coming in at yeah. that point. How do you feel? Like, what's your reaction? It, 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 <laughs> it's really, um, Sean, it, it, what, what happened there, it was I was unable to celebrate because um, almost three, three to 4,000 people 
were on the website trying to get a bull mm. and the bulls went it to 900 people okay and this was really something that 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 um touched me uh significant and it took me two days to recover from this because um as you can understand six thousand people in discord um and just 900 uh, of yeah. them that were the experts on dealing with the gas uh transactions and minting mm -hmm. the the bulls and i i received hundreds of messages saying i was born on, on the wars and and, uh, and you need to fix this and i believed in this i stated this in in the beginning i this was my first nft etc cetera, etc cetera. Yes. so the amount of messages uh, asking me to to fix it just uh, pushing the, the project down and stating that uh, it, 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 it was a problem um, really took the, the perspective of deploying something uh, almost perfectly in 40 days from scratch and, and, and doing um, a 1.6 million heroes, wow. almost 2K, 2, 2 million uh, pounds, uh, or uh, no, it's it's, it's, it's 1.3 million pounds sale in 19 minutes. It it really goes away because when you are, you are you. I was really engaged with with those people, and I was really hoping that they could buy a book. Okay, so yeah. th it was really a bittersweet moment. Yeah. Um, I understood now. Um, it took me a full week to understand and to cope with. Uh, gas wars are part of the equation and if people are minting they need to understand that the minting price it's not 0 0.08 it's 0 0.08 plus, plus the, the amount of gas that yeah. you need to do and if you are not technically literate literate enough to understand that you you can't adjust the limit of the gas and that uh, you need to fast the transaction or else you will you will um, be out of the game, et cetera. And uh, this is up to you. It's not up to the project really to be yeah. responsible for that, okay? So we ended up compensating the transaction fees that um, were at, at the last minute and people put the transaction, but there were not tokens to be minted. So those were compensated by an unlucky bull that I, I draw. We also paid um, a significant amount of gas fees that were uh, our responsibility to pay, but uh, we ended up with with a lot of people that. Threw... So you, did you create? Yep. Did you, just create. Just create. Right? Did you create a, a, a drawing with, with unlucky ball? Yeah, I did. Yeah, so I did. Uh, <laughs> so everybody got one. Forty-seven people. Yeah. Forty-seven people. Yeah. Uh, uh, tried to mint a bull. Yeah. And the only reason that they didn't get a bull was because uh, the last bull was already sold. So the transaction went through, uh, but the last bull was already sold at the moment. So it, it was a problem of the simultaneous purchase at yeah. the last minute. Okay. So hmm. I did um, a celebrity bull, an honorary bull that was the unlucky bull. It, it is a purple bull with a 13 uh, draw. So yeah. it, it was, um, and it was sent as a token of uh, gratitude and appreciation for them, uh, and they can sell it and and value it on on that. Respect that, okay. man. I respect that. I respect that. It was, <laughs> it was uh, one of the things that we did. The other one was pay, pay for the transaction fees at, at that that point that were our responsibility. Yeah. And um, and 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 we 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 moved on to to the next page that was to to bring value to the community yeah in order for them to understand that this was just the beginning of the, of the journey okay so yeah. this was this was it so since, oh, so i was going to say yeah. since then since then there's, there's a lot of things obviously that have happened um one thing i, I don't, I don't want to make sure we touch on because i know we we limp the time is to make sure i know that obviously you got floyd may celebrities so i'm not i'm not sure if there's any other celebrities but i know that floyd mayweather it did he's did he actually purchasable or did he read because you made yeah. it yeah yeah you so um the, the the the, the um, let, let me just uh tackle first uh ja rule is also oh, ja rule. so this these things yeah. i missed that like okay and so yeah, yeah ja rule bought okay. a bull yesterday and uh, wow. we 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 are excited about that but but let's let's go to the floyd mayweather story because this one is is important i can we uh can we have 10 extra minutes 
like we're good for time yeah. like, i'm flexible for time okay. don't worry man we'll right. just yeah I, i'm not so <laughs> let's, let's, I, like, I will i'll try to wrap it up in, in 10 minutes yeah let's let's just um, um let, let, let me just talk bulls on the block has, has, has deployed um the the july roadmap um in in pretty much uh 100 fashion and we have done a lot of things and one of the key aspects is the bear drop that we'll we'll do on the 31st of july so every bull uh, will have a match token ID of a bear. And uh -huh. if you own five bear, five bulls, you'll get five bears free. You just need to pay the gas. So this has been hugely anticipated and expected for the community. It has pushed our floor to close to 0.30 now. So it's oh. still really affordable for you to buy a, a bull and you'll get um, a matching bear until the 31st of July. So I would incentivize everyone to, to, to really get a, a, a bull to get this because the bears are unbelievable good. We learned a lot from the algorithm and the, the rarity perspective when we draw the bulls mm -hmm. and, and, and we, we took all the, the, um, the perspective of the, um, the community uh, to how we, we should, we should deploy the bears. So it's, it, it, it will be it will be massive. So I, I would really recommend people to to found to to find the the, the bulls and 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 get a matching bear uh, okay. uh, that will be dropped on the twenty the thirty first. If this the show airs later than thirty first, um, I hope that they they we could uh, uh, we could consolidate the hype on bulls on the block on on this perspective, but also on the other points. Okay, so. Um, Back to Floyd Mayweather. Uh, trades projects are, are are always um, looking for um, looking for um, ways to attract uh, celebrities because we saw um, if they change the avatar um, profile for like twenty four hours or forty eight hours to to our trades, it means to our trades for avatar. It means that the celebrities at least aware and committed and 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 this makes it's an endorsement, um, isn't it? it's an endorsement it's an endorsement way like we see jay-z do you see mike tyson do with the cool cats so yeah it, it gives you that kind of not credibility because they've already got credit with the community but it gives you that awareness of a bit of more you know yeah. like so it, uh, yeah it, it is it is that that way it's not something that you expect that non-crypto natives or no non-nft spaces will fly and buy you um tons of new bulls okay yeah. uh, but uh, but but we see that there is momentum okay uh, and, and it's interesting because it, it's engagement on twitter and and, and it's nice so we uh, i ended up drawing um um uh, in 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 the live session i i draw floyd mayweather yeah and we 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 pushed it to through through the 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 rules and then i draw a picture of the bull raising floyd's uh, hand as a champion we did a twitter on on a tweet on that and it was, it was retweeted by Floyd Mayweather, and he ended up buying a bull on that perspective. So he did. He really uh, bought a bull. Mm. So it's from his his account. It's not uh, an airdrop from us uh, yeah. on that that point. Okay. So, but um, but but the, the story goes on, Sean. And now is the the point where I'm I'm revealing you for for the first time uh, my bulls on the block uh, team um, already knows. Yeah, two moderators know, one investor knows, and um, and of course the development team knows. But what we have done is that we have secured the first celebrity trades project of, uh, for Floyd Mayweather, and we'll deploy a collection of trades. Uh, the first celebrity trades project will be pushed and powered by Bulls on the Block uh, wow. with Floyd Mayweather. Okay. Okay. So. The we have seen animals so far, trees and um, robots and uh, um, whatever things that we have seen, but um, we will deploy and we'll communicate today. Okay, the 29th, I think, 28th or 29th, we are recording this. It's the 20, oh, wait, 29th, yeah, the 29th, 29th, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's the 29th. Okay, so 20, uh, today we'll we'll do. A teaser of uh, the coming soon uh, drop, and we will communicate to bull owners that will 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 be responsible for 
the trades project of the first the first trades project of a celebrity in in the world so we have secured as bulls on the block yeah. to replicate the dynamic and the um, and um, the 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 success that we did for bulls on the block mm -hmm. based on um uh, floyd mayweather so what we'll see is an amount of um, tokens, okay, that I, I can't reveal uh, with, with you still, but it, okay. it will be similar to the other ones, okay, the other project that we have seen, okay. So we have uh, um, Floyd um, drawn and uh, algorithm uh, um, uh, presented yeah. uh, with everything that is uh, related to him. So, but now what you need to understand, Sean, is that when we present an animal as an avatar, we project utility related to airdrops, metaverse, and uh, um, probably a gaming perspective or something like that. Mm -hmm. that that's what we have seen. Okay, mm -hmm. When you are drawing a celebrity and you are pushing the first traits project for a celebrity, you project a utility that has nothing to do with it. That is hugely and, and uh, disproportionate, okay? And we have 25 items of utility that we are pushing forward on this project. So you will have access to um, exclusive content on the community that will be built. You'll yeah. have, have access to exclusive um, media that will be built. You'll have, have access to an airdrop with the uh, Floyd's um, spirit animal. You will have access to um, information, uh, to, to, to gifts on the drop. Okay, so you, 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 you mint the, the NFT, you'll have immediately two gifts that are related to personal content and to uh, new NFTs that you'll immediately get. Okay, yeah. then you'll have access to um, TBE, the, the best ever ecosystem of the, the boxing yeah. ecosystem. You'll have access to uh, the champ himself, okay? And it has a component also of um, uh, charity, okay? We have a partnership with, with um, and we'll, we'll give a certain amount of meals for every NFT that is sold. So we, there are seven areas of utility that will encapsulate 25 different utilities for them um, to be, um, a release to to the the, um, the owners of of the tokens okay and this will be the answer to the process can celebrities do trades projects without being a, ca a cash grab okay mm -hmm. because not only the pricing will blow everyone's minds off because if you are you familiar with stoner cats uh, yeah, obviously, yeah, some days they sold out. Yeah, yeah Ashley they Kushner. sold out. Uh, yeah, Ashley Kushner, uh, yeah. they sold out a really couple of days ago. I, I think it's Tuesday. Yeah. Uh, with a with a minting point of 4, 0.35. Okay. Okay. So that is pretty high. That yeah. is very, very, very high. And and when when you think celebrity, you think of everything that was done in the space so far that was Oh, uh, it's a celebrity. You need to pay one ETH because you are yeah. paying for the image, and he's an NFT. Yeah. And 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 actually, um, uh, there is a, a Floyd uh, um, uh, dropped an NFT uh, in June based yes, on this I was in the clubhouse. I was in the clubhouse. Yeah. So it's, it's a legendary one. That so it went for about, went for about hundred grand, didn't it? Yeah. So oh, that yeah. was uh, the one to one. It yeah. was about one hundred grand. Yeah. But the 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 the, the topics. The way it was approached is mm -hmm. different because you and they had like a, a one that was four ETH, one that was one ETH, and mm -hmm. one that was 0.25 yeah. or 0.15. And the 0.15 is just the NFT. Yeah. And when when you don't understand the space as well, you yeah. ended up trying to. Okay, so we are uh, in the NFT bubble. We just do a kind of um, drawing or visual, etc. And and we follow the steps of the other NF, the other celebrities. That's yeah. that one. And, and it doesn't work well because the, the NFT space, the, the buyer is different. Mm -hmm. It wants 
utility. It wants to see the, uh, it wants to understand that is probably, there is assurance that the investment will raise in value, or at least mm -hmm. you will get benefit that will surpass the value that he invested on. Okay, so, the, and, and the, the people that dropped, the celebrities that dropped um, at, at the last six months, Mm -hmm. didn't understand clearly the NFT space. And this, is, this was yeah. a problem because they were really understood as cash grabs. Yeah. What we are doing is that we are bringing massive utility and value on the NFT. We are not pushing a higher price and we are deploying with people that really understand the space. So it, yeah. it's the connected perspective of uh, the, the power of the celebrity, the execution, of a team that already is experienced in, in the space and the leveraging, the leveraging of the process within a community because we will have the option to do the pre-sale, some of the pre-sale only accessible to bulls on the block owners and they can opt in if they see value on this, okay? Mm -hmm. So from the community within, from Rui Duarte within, from the NFT Floyd uh, perspective and from the celebrity it's, itself, you have a fourth path of communication, build yeah. up and utility projection. Uh, and, and, and for this, we will do, hopefully it will, will, will go um, very nicely. And we have the first use case of a celebrity drop of a trades project for, 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 for a celebrity, okay? So uh, it all began with, um, with uh, a drawing of Floyd Mayweather that um, it, 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 it took, it took uh, much more uh, than it, it ended up being much more than a, a celebrity 24 hours uh, transformation of an avatar and it became um, a new partnership a new interaction and 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 a new way for us to to redefine the, the trades projects perspective because mm -hmm. what we are doing now is migrating from animals and 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 um, and pickles and bananas and yeah. whatever <laughs> to a different, a different space. Mm -hmm. and, and you need to understand, Sean, that it's, it, it's a tricky space because what we have seen so far is that the NFT space, the connoisseurs push celebrities back because they say, you don't understand this and you are really just trying to get our money. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I, I totally agree. So, it's a conversation we have. I'm, I'm in having the community. I'm in a, yeah. I was only speaking about it the other day in a clubhouse. And this mm -hmm. is the, this so is the approach this is, has. This is the, the approach. But what we have seen so far is that neither the celebrities understand the space, neither those that are influencing the space on the NFT want the celebrities here. Because as you saw in Stoner Cats, $700,000 was missed due to the gas problems. Mm -hmm. And it was minted at 0.35. So this is money that goes to the celebrities and is not retained by those that are influencers and launch uh, projects within the NFT space community. Mm -hmm. Okay, And this is pretty, it's easy to understand because if you, you master the space, imagine some, uh, an influencer, they, they master the space and they have huge plans and they want to, to cater to these 40K people and they don't want the celebrities to take a part of the cake. If yeah. the celebrities really master the game, they will transfer some of the NFT uh, investment to them. But there is a, a, an added upside that is critical. That is some of the team, the, the persons that are new to the space and but they are in love with the community, they will come to the process, okay? We mm -hmm. are expecting to, to, to sell from 80 to 90% to NFT natives, yes. but we will hopefully uh, onboard, because we have the tools for that, we will onboard 10% that, that are really people that love Floyd Mayweather and yes. through the process of selling that it, it will not be... Um, a gas war uh, that is projected, they will be having the possibility to to get a token by, by Floyd. Okay, and mm. and 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 this is the this is the story. We will um, drop um, the first um, 
Celebrity Traits Project, and we couldn't be more excited about than wow. we are now. Okay, so there's, there's an exclusive man, and like I'm, I'm yeah, excited because, and the thing is, what you've done there, and I was, I was only having this conversation the other day. I mean, I know you tapped wrapped up for time, so we're just going to quickly wrap it up, but. I was talking about this, yeah. this whole approach on celebrities, people coming to the space, not understanding the space, the community trying to protect yeah. the community. But there's also that side of if celebrities come, come in and they're, they're accompanied or they're, they're with people that understand the space like yourself and they, yeah. and they assist and they do it correctly. It's only going to benefit the space because you're going to get people are going to transfer that are not in the crypto space or the NT space mm-hmm. and come to the market, which is going to help it grow. It's common sense, yeah. but um, it needs to be done properly. And I'm glad, obviously, you guys... You clearly yeah. understand the space. You're you you well invested. You 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 got good intention, and yeah. I just look forward to the. I look forward to the project. Like I'm, I'm excited, yeah. man. That that is the key part because when when you are a, a, so I had 100 approaches for projects as as you 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 of course understand. Yeah. And and we we saw the full scope. We saw, guys. Uh, I have an idea. Let's let's draw a unicorn, and we will split the revenues. Okay. So. The guy was just connecting because he had an idea of a unicorn and he want a piece of the, the cake. So yeah. this is this is make no sense at all because I can also have the idea of the unicorn and I don't need to share the reference. Okay. Yeah. So this 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 kind of uh, strategy we saw, but what we saw here is someone that said, and, and really we need to understand this, and this is really interesting. Is that from Floyd Mayweather's perspective is the, the perspective of being humble to say, we don't understand the space, you execute it to perfection, help us deploy this mm-hmm. by setting the way that you think this could be a success. It's different, it's completely different because it's not the celebrity that is saying, do this way, it's the guys from Bulls on the Block that are advising the celebrity to drop this way. And it's really the reverse perspective. And this is really something that you need to take uh, the hat off of the celebrity. Because yeah. he, when you see this, you can see, okay, Floyd Mayweather can do whatever he likes. And if he says it's like this, then you'll do like this. So whatever. But the team has the, this humble perspective of what, what you guys think of it as experts and as you deploy this well let's follow your lead and of course we'll give you um that the um, not only the content the support but also the advice and insights for this to happen well within the floyd's ecosystem because that, yeah. that is that is obviously critical so when yeah. you see today the first teaser sean yes um um bearing to uh, uh, your mind that it's um, almost a, a three week work that we have done with that obviously a bigger team now okay mm. my friend my friend that was advising me on on on, on the march uh, approach NFTs. one yeah. one yeah <laughs> and uh, he's now on on board and and is working with us on 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 the flights project and we have a bigger team of course now but this will be the second stage for bulls on the block. The first one was to optimize bulls on the block. The second one was to replicate bulls on the block mm-hmm. in distinctive context, in distinctive uh, con- uh, contexts. And this will be the first moment where we'll we'll do. Of course, wow. we, we will try to do the virtual cycle. We deploy um, uh, Floyd Mayweather's um, first. Um, uh, trades project and the first celebrity trades project and this will have value hopefully to bulls on the block and then um, um, this this will become a, a virtual cycle that we can hopefully onboard different perspectives not only celebrities but brands that, that, that uh, content etc and when, when you were mentioning um, celebrities and brands having trouble and you saw yesterday uh, we saw Coca-Cola and Dolce and Gabbana uh, trying Pringles. to enter into the space yeah. and, and Pringles yeah. and the approach the approach is the same the approach is the approach from within it's mm-hmm. not the approach for them to understand the space and understand what can resonate with with the NFT so so and and they will fail and this is why you saw you saw Jay Z um, uh, pushing forward um, an NFT in Sotheby's. That was uh, in value. I, I, I don't know 
I can. I, I, I think it went for. I think it went for nineteen. No, it was. You was in the hundred thousand, hundred thousand again, wasn't it? Oh, was it not? Nineteen Ethereum. I, I, I yeah. think that that I have that number in mind. I don't yeah. want to. Okay, I can't to, really to be wrong. Uh, on yeah, that. don't shoot us. We don't actually know. But I mean, we're, <laughs> I can't remember. Yeah, but you, yeah, you went, can, <laughs> But it was very low. Yeah. Uh, because because it it really doesn't resonate with the space, and if it really resonates to the space, the NFT community will pay much more. Okay. Yes. But. Yeah. Um, if it's just an NFT, it will end up um, being purchased by 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 someone that really uh, is in love with the, the celebrity, but doesn't really understand uh, the, the the process. So we are setting new ground again. Um, we 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 push this forward on bulls on the block by pushing the the visibility and the aesthetics part, and also the community wallet that is being copied. Yeah. And now with, with, with Floyd, we'll have not only the community wallet, but also uh, a lot of uh, content, access to the champ, um, utility projected, utility de delivered on, on, the, on the drop, uh, also an airdrop assured for at a later stage with an avatar animal project that is the spirit animal of Floyd. Oh. So it is, um, it is a no brainer investment for those that are um, um, aware of um, what the trades project can can deploy at a later stage, and hopefully, it will su succeed, and um, and we will 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 set a new user case and project the, the trades um, scene to a different um, area that other than than pickles, bananas, and yeah. <laughs> and, uh, and animals. Okay, so this is well, the story. Like I, said, I think what I'm going to do is end it on that point because I know you're short for time and I, like, yeah. we've gone over time already, but I appreciate that you've even shared this this news uh, with regards to okay. what you're doing. It's amazing. I'm excited. I'm, I'm sure yeah. the audience can get excited. I'm definitely going to push it and obviously get it out there and help you guys get it out there to the, to the, to the audience that want, would appreciate this. And also yeah. your, your whole journey has been amazing. Like it's, it's always good to have these chats because looking on the outside, I wouldn't. I haven't. I, I wouldn't. I wasn't aware of what you've done, your journey, how far you've come, the involvement you have with the community, yeah. it, to that perspective. And it's always good for you, for people to hear your story, so they can understand mm -hmm. the people that are actually making moves and influencing and and take, yeah, being the leaders in the space to a certain extent. So, um, I'll take my hat off to you, and I, I keep. I want to keep supporting what you guys are doing. Excited for all the projects that are to come too, because I'm sure this isn't going to be your last mm -hmm. one. Excellent. It was a pleasure. It, it flew by, so it's, uh, it was good. Excellent. Thank yeah. you. Thank you for having me, Sean.